we're rolling? Yep. So through the chord. Chord, second string, open, close. So we want to target that second string. Through the chord, second string, open, close. Four, two, four. And then chord as a whole again. Open, and then second string. Right, so. Second string, open chord, two, three, and four. Just a little clip on the open chord. Second finger, G. We've learned about our bass notes, right? This is our big root note, G, E, F, G, yeah? So a little open G chord, two, three, and four. And then two, one, two strings, two, one, two, third finger, second string, third fret. Then we just let this one go, third finger comes back, second finger goes on the fourth string. And we're on, off, on, little finger on third fret, and then we get an upstroke on the top string. So that part came together really easily for you, right? So just put it all back in context again, the whole thing. Then we go back and do exactly the same thing on the D chord again. Open chord G. This time, first finger comes to the top string, first string, second fret. And we strum three strings, three, two, one. Open, and then this guy comes back on the second string, third fret, and we get a little upstroke on him on two and three. Well, just two is fine, right? So G part is now different, D part the same. So the G part, second G part is to come, I open chord, G, first finger, on, off, strumming top three strings, and then little upstroke on the second string, coming back, right? And then it's just the A7 chord, that one we were playing before, but we don't do the on, off, on again. Just have one, two, three, four. Okay, I'll play through this all together now, right? So... Same thing. Two open tap. Four, two, four. Four open, second string, and G. New melody. Over that note. slowly all the way through. Seven, two notes, same fret, second fret, fourth and second string, downstrokes, four downstrokes. Okay, that's the whole verse. Okay, let's stop it there.